Good morning, guys. Uh, let's see, we are day nine, almost two weeks into our challenge. And I just wanted to check in to see how everybody was making out. Um, if there was any questions at this point, does anybody struggle with anything they need some extra help with? Um, last year, or last week rather, I was struggling with the internet, so um, I wanted to make sure that you got a really good variation on the tricep dips because there's a lot of different ways to do it and some cool stuff that I've learned over the years uh, through my various workout programs um, to change it up a bit too. So um, today is planks, dips, and mountain climbers. I think everybody's got the mountain climbers down. Um, the plank is pretty easy. Everybody kind of does those with most of their programs as it is. Um, so that leaves us with the tricep dips. So if you have a chair, you can actually use it for one variation. I will sit on the back of the chair and you want to basically make sure that your back is parallel to the chair when you go up and down. Hands are facing forward and you're going up, down, up, down. Now this is the easiest way to do it. If you want to make it more advanced, you take your legs out straight and go up, down. I can do it without really bending my knees. It's, it's tough. Um, or another variation is to bring one leg in and do it like that. Now, another way that I always do dips and, and change things up is you can do it the opposite. Put your feet up on the chair, hands in forward, pick your butt up, hold your butt off the floor and do it that way. Um, and you can also do that with one leg too, whether it's up, switch legs. These are way harder for sure. But if you're looking to challenge yourself, that's a good way. And you can always just do them on the floor. That works too. You can just go up and down on the floor. You can put your legs out. You know, you need to do it however it's comfortable for you. You definitely want to make sure that the proper form is A, number one, because if you don't have the form, you're not going to get the results. I can't say that enough. Um, and so, you know, don't try to go super fast to, to, to catch up and be, um, you know, in a certain amount of time. Um, you really just want to focus on your form. If that means taking breaks in between sets, then do that um, to get through all of the numbers. So um, let me know if you have any questions. I'm going to post um, some meal plans today. Um, obviously, your nutrition is the most important part of any exercise program. Um, it's 80% of the equation. So if you don't have the proper nutrition and you're not eating healthy and the right portions, then you're not going to see it, the results that you're looking for. So message me if you have any questions and have a great day.